Okay, so I just want to do a quick uh, recap of my Zombicide Season 3 Kickstarter. Um, told my friend I would show him all the content real quick. Uh, back in the day, he, he backed um, Zombicide uh, Season 1, and it was a pretty big thing back then, and he and I went in on the Apocalypse uh, before Zombicide came out, and I still think that the Apocalypse is a pretty good game. The The pieces are kind of ugly, but, I mean the map pieces, but, and the miniatures are not really super awesome. But I think uh, gameplay is still really good. And, um, excuse the mess. And when Zombicide Season 3 came about, I noticed something. You know, you can support, like, well, it's a squad based game. I mean, it can be played that, that way. Um,. And it supports like 12 people, up to 12 people. You know, when you think about it, Zombicide Season 3 plays a lot like the Apocalypse. And, uh, I think, I still think the Apocalypse's, um, combat system is better. It's, it just is. So, uh, but other than that, Zombicide was a more popular game, and... Their miniatures are pretty awesome, so whether you paint them or not, they're still pretty cool. So anyways, um, I'd like to preface that I never owned any of the Zombicide games. So anyways, uh, when I heard about Zombicide 3, Season 3, and then I saw, I read a little bit of how the game plays, and I thought, oh, that's a lot like the Apocalypse. I could just get that and uh, probably find more people interested in playing just because of the Zombicide name. But it's gonna play like the game that I really like. I really enjoy. So uh, I went ahead and backed it, and it came with a crap load of stuff. Uh, if you backed season three, then you know. And if you purchased um, season three uh, from someone who's selling their stuff on eBay, then you know. And you got the Kickstarter and all that stuff. You know, it came with a ton of stuff, and you didn't have to buy all the add-ons to get. Tons and tons of zombies and things. So, <clears throat> I backed um, Season 3 and Angry Neighbors. And, you know, I just wanted all the extras. Or all, all the stretch goals. I didn't want to get any of the add-ons. Um, and then when I backed Black Plague, I actually bailed out at, at the Kickstarter. And at the very last minute, you, you know, I, I didn't really want to do that. At the very last minute, I jumped back on board because they unlocked pre they even unlocked all the stretch goals. So it's like, well, I, I gotta go back. <laughs> they unlocked everything. So, um, and it came with a crap ton more stuff. Um, I'm not sure if it's the same amount, but there are a lot fewer Kickstarter exclusives, I think, which I'm in favor of because, like I said, I I I only backed the game, the expansion. And, uh, you know, I'm getting all the stretch goals. Um, and if I feel like it, I'd, I'd like to be able to get all the other exclusives. Now, there's like three or four Kickstarter exclusives in the, in the Black Plague, but um, there's just a lot of stuff there. Anyway, so, having said that, I'm going to start with the character cards. And so, get this nifty um, card holder. Or, uh, I guess, player mat holder. And it barely fits all the character cards. It has all of them. Up until Season 3. But, you know, there aren't any... Um, I don't have all the miniatures to match, of course. I just got... Because they up they updated all the original characters. And gave them zombie vo zombie vores. Zombie survivors. You know, you can, you can play as such as... Uh, when your your character dies, they become a zombie, like a hero with zombie of sorts. So they updated all the original cards and all the way up till Zombie Side Season Three. So I have all the character cards. 
um, not including the any of the add-ons. Um, and then they got all these extra uh, sliding car uh, plastic pieces to track, or uh, what are they, uh, experience trackers. So, here are all, check that out, that's like an inch thick of um, character cards. And they're all, this this one in front happens to be the the Austin Powers look-alike, Thiago. And then on the back, of course, shows him in the, as a zombie. Um, I think this is the original character, uh, the Cardboard Tube sa Samurai. I don't know, is that what he's called? That, that's what it says on the card. So, looks like he's straight out of, uh, I don't know what. Troy is, oh, it's Bruce Campbell, right? Here he is. And then, here's his zombie, Troy. And then, of course, in Black Plague, we're going to get, um, uh, I can't remember his name. In, uh, in Black Plague, but we're going to get Ash and Evil Ash. From, uh, was it Evil Dead 2? Can't remember. Haven't seen those movies in a long time. I'm, I'm a fan. I enjoyed those movies when I was a kid, but I'm not a super huge fan. I haven't seen them recently. Um, and here are the, uh, special weapons. We got a Desert Eagle, a golden one. And then, uh, the Murder of Crows. Which we'll see plenty more of in Black Plague. Um, and then these are... Uh, what are these? These are the ones with the stars in them. I forget what they are. Um, I I, I played I did a playthrough of the intro scenario one time a little while back, but I haven't touched the game since then. Um, so those are the character cards. Oh, and we have uh the team building deck. If you want to randomize it, I I've unwrapped it, but I threw it back in the box. Um, just for storage. <clears throat> And here we go. I'll put these back in the box. So, because my friend, uh, he backed, was it the Banner Saga recently? Today? And uh, he was saying that he came with lots of stuff. And I was like, well, you know, for, for what you paid for it, it, that's a pretty good price. Because he was saying it's kind of pricey. But I told him, Zombicide with the expansion that they create with the, the current set. Um, it's like almost 200 bucks, just those. Then he's going to get everything they offer, but then again, um, Zombicide is like, they give you, like I said, they give you a crap ton of stuff. So, um, I'll pull out Zom uh, Room Org first. Here's a box, nice fat. Zombicide box. It's the same size as all the other ones, I believe. But it's heavy. And I, I, I move stuff around a little bit. So, check that out. Here's the instruction book. The original, which I borrowed from my friend, has like eight pages. And look how thick that is. If I can hold this right. This has 57 pages. 60 pages. 60 some pages. Okay. It's really thick. I think the original instruction book had more than eight pages, but it was like a fold out or something. It was really tiny, really skinny. So I got the dice bag, of course. You you guys seen this? And I have the extra set of dice in here already. But you get all the custom dice. I got um, yellow and brown dice in here. I have a poop color. <laughs> Um, the token, all the tokens, spawn points, and things like that. All the experience cards, skills, and whatnot. Um, where are these? Weapons. Got weapons here. And we got wound cards. And some other stuff. I don't think they're all wound cards, but because there's a ton of them. Maybe they are, I don't know. I'm not gonna open the bag. Um... In this box, I forget what's in I think these are the characters it comes with. Six of them. And you get those matching zombivores. So already you're getting twice as much as the original game. 
There they are. And I'm, uh, I would like to paint them, but I'm not a skilled painter, so uh, I ended up writing the names on the bottom so I know who's who. Um, but you got the, uh, you got the the uh, survivors here. And then you have their zombie kind of parts here. So, um, actually no. What is, what's going on here? Well, maybe. Let's see. Travis? No, they're all different names. See, that, that's how, how long it's been since I've touched this. I have no idea who's who. Um, so you get 12 characters, right? And none of them have zombies. I, oh, I know. So th you get 12 characters, and then I have another box here with their zombie counterparts. And I'll go ahead and pull that out. Um, just so I can keep everything straight. So there's your characters in this box. And this box is so packed full. I remember my friend loaned me his Zombicide, his original one. And um, there's a lot of empty space in there. <laughs> um, here they are. So here's uh, the uh, Lost Zombivores. It's the, uh, the 12 characters zombie forms. There they are. So you're you're basically you're getting twice as many miniatures right off the bat because of these characters because you you gotta have the I don't need to take these out. So they have more zombie cards, which I don't remember why these are. But they are, and they have like Spanish on them or something. Um, then here I'll show you briefly. Here's the twelve, twelve uh, zombie counterparts to the uh, the characters that came with the game, and that's an extra set. I mean, I guess you don't have to have them. It's just I mean, if you paint them, it'll be super awesome. But um, I'm not gonna paint them. So, oh, my back's killing me already. Ugh. Okay. So, check out this huge box. This is the zombies. And I, you know what? I don't know. I think I I have an extra bonus abomination. A, a female one. I have two females in the mail. I don't know if anyone got that. I'm pretty sure because it's like in the in the set. So check this out. There are three trays of zombies here. Ah, and you have walkers. These are all walkers in this tray. Um. We have crawlers and look like fatties here. And there's the okay, so crawlers up here, here, and then fatties down here. And then we have our first abomination. It's a male because I don't see any place for boobs. Not that they're too prominent in the uh, in, in on the female, but there's he is. The monstrous arms can grab you from an adjacent um, zone. And then here are the runners. Three kinds. So stack them. That's neat. So already you can you can sort of imagine. There's a grip load of stuff here. I guess I could just refer my friend to um, any number of unboxing videos, but I'm going to try to go through this really fast. Um, these are team actions. Um, 
These are like the covered tents. One side that shows them, ooh, I wonder what's under there. And then another side when you tear through them, that's where zombies could be hiding and stuff. Treasures and stuff like that. Uh, the, the helicopter. We get to fly the helicopter and crash it. And then the map tiles. Uh, there's one in there I can't quite grab yet. One, two, three. And there's nine of them all together. So the map tiles. Double sided. Okay. So I'm going to pack this real quick. Fits just about right. Just about. Alright, that's a chock full. I don't know. I'm not sure what to expect of the Black Plague. So, there's that. Okay, and then, um, this is on the wars. Then we have. Might as well pull this out. Got the box of zombies. The bonus ones. The guy in the. Looks like they're from the carnival and whatnot. Um, I really want to paint this one. Um, mostly because there's a lot of, a lot of surface area. Not, not a whole lot of details in, in some of them. So that'll be easy for a, a noob like me not to screw them all up. But you got the guy dressed up as a hot dog. And uh, you got the pimp, a surgeon, and a cook. And I'm not, I think this, I have no idea what that guy is. He's got dog tags on in the, in the picture. So he could be like a strung out vet, I don't know. Uh, or some kind of goth guy. Trying to look cool. And then you can... I don't know if you can tell. These decks I have not even opened yet. But they're they're the custom ones uh, that come with these zombies. They're... Um, yeah. <laughs> they're cards. But you can see... Uh, well, I don't know if you can see them. Maybe. They're still in the plastic. Uh, all those guys. So that came as a stretch goal with bonuses. Oh, I forgot this. <laughs> there we go. The infected pack with figures. Oh, there we go. I don't know if you can see all those. Oh. Here. I don't want them to pop out. They're not really secure in there. Um, got the Murder of Crows. Got the 3D the barricade or something. Obstacles. Um, here's where you get the double bonus. So here's the female. Abomination. This will focus on her. Maybe you can see her... Mounds. I don't know. It's not going to focus. Focus. Whatever. You can probably see them. But anyways, that's a female. You get a lot of horns on her. A lot of blades. That Maybe that, that's good enough to tell the difference. There's a female. And there's another male in here. So. We got. I love these. So. Let's see. Doc. Oh. Derp. We got House. I'm sure this is House. Dr. House. He goes by Doc. Gosh. I don't know how you guys do it. The, the guys who do the weekly stuff. Jesse, who is, who is uh, Gordon Ramsay. I like that one. I might, want, I might have to paint that one. Um, and they're Zombivores. They're matching Zombivores. Um, I have them labeled on the bottom. You can see. Maybe you can see if it'll focus a little bit. Just wrote the name on the bottom. Uh, won't focus. Anyways, I wrote the names on the bottom. So there's four, four guys here. There's cat. Oh, this is uh, Daisy Duke. 
Was it De Debbie Dun Debbie Dun uh, Dunham Dun Dunning? Dang it! My memory fails me. There's their zombie one. Um, and then more crawlers, more fatties, more walkers. Um, a couple of runners, a few runners, I think. And then um, here's the here's the other male. See, three of them. So um, you got more. These are I forget what the black ones are for. I forget, but they're they're supposed to be really scary. Um, the black ones. I don't remember why. Um, and then we have more of these guys. More bonus, uh, crackers and zombie wars. So we have, and this, uh, this set was heavy in, in the Big Bang Theory, but I only got a couple, a couple of folks. Here's Raj. He's got a samurai sword. Let's see if I can get it to focus. No? Where's the camera? There it is. There we go. A little bit of focus. Raj got a samurai sword. Kabir is his name. Oh, I, I had to get the Walter White one. That's what sucked me back in. So, here's Walter White. You, you know I never finished watching Breaking Bad. I only got to like the third season. I forgot sick of it. Binge watching it. I'll go back to it though. Um, There he is in his hat. And then here he is in his uh, mask. His dust mask. I don't know if you can see that. Gosh. Focus. No? Okay. But that's him in there. And then we have... Who is this? Yuri. Oh. Was it... Um, Kiefer in 24. What's it? Uh, Jack uh, Bauer. Right? I believe that's who it is. Yuri. And then... What else we got? We have Zoolander with the dual axes. Zoolander. And then, um, who's this guy? Lucius. Ah, uh, gosh. You, know, me, you guys don't know, I'm sure. He goes by Lucius. Um, I forget what movie to pull them from. Oh, uh, uh. Yeah, I can't think of it. The old one with Alyssa Milano when she's a kid. Um, and Seth. Who is Seth? I don't know who Seth is. There he is. Seth. Okay. Not that you guys can really see, but... So there are those. So 12 more. Um... Or six. Six more people. Six more bonus characters. A murder of crows. Let's see. No more of these. They're like very infected persons. Scary lady. Yeah, we got a soldier here. Yeah, sorry about it. It won't focus. Um, those are just a break, I guess. So, we have that. Those are all the bonuses. So, three abominations. Alright. Okay. Oh, and I have uh, Amy Firefowler. Uh, my, my, um, my, uh, yeah. Can't think of the name. She had, she had a weird name, anyways. It goes by Audrey. And I still don't know where I should put her. But she's got her own... Um, she got a chainsaw and her own little card counter. Experience counter. And so I just leave her in her box. Her own private box. I'm not going to sell this stuff. Um, that's just me. Even if it doesn't get played. It's, it's a nice um, conversation piece. There. Audrey the Bookworm. All right, now Angry Neighbors.
and this this box feels more like this is the expansion. It feels more like the same weight as the original Zombicide, I would say. And this is just the expansion. So again, it's, it's set up a lot like the Zombicide box, just a little bit skinnier, a little shorter. Um, wound cards. Let's see, I knew they weren't all wound cards. Now wound cards, and then zombie cards. Ugh. Zombie cards. And uh, weapons or items. Zom Knuckles, Energy Drink, Nico Special. Can you see that? Yeah, barely. Okay. There are those. Come on. Alright. So I left the character cards in here because I just I didn't have any more room in the, the case. So what I did was I, w I made sure I made sure all the core characters were in there, and plus all the cool um, let's see all the cool parodied ones. I mean, th there's some here. Looks like that one looks like Sylvester Stallone. Jeff, you guys can correct me on that. Julian, I think. Oh yeah. Okay. So these are the bonus characters. Um, and maybe the ones I didn't have. Oh no, I did. I got. I got uh, my bad. I have um, the miniatures for these. I forget how I separated them. Anyways, here's Audrey, and she already looks pretty scary <laughs> without being a zombie. But here's her zombie persona. Got a chainsaw. Spencer, which is Walter White. Uh, Brian Cranston. I, it's for, I I went to school with a kid named Brian Cranston, um, but he's not the the actor. There you go. I mean, he might be an actor. I don't know, but he's not this one. Uh, Seth. I can see. Okay, I. Oh, oh, Liam Neeson. Ha ha. Can you see that? I don't know if you can see that. But if you could see it, you'd be like, ah, oh, that's Liam Neeson. From Taken. There's Ross. Uh, Raj. Sorry, not Ross. Raj. Doc. Daisy Duke. Right? Some guys are saying, some kids were claiming she was like someone else, but... Nope, kids, that's Daisy Duke, the original. I know, I know, you think, uh, you think, uh, Jessica Simpson was the original one, but she's not. Bastion, Zoolander. There you go, dual axes. Um, Lucius. From the professional. Yeah, I remembered. Yeah. Right, and Jesse, Gordon Ramsay with his frying pan and his dual uh, chef knife and cleaver. Yeah, love that. Okay, got more tokens for hazards and things for the game. Let's see what's in here, and then the rest are like unknown things. Got some hillbillies, some redneck some neighbors. Yeah. Here they are. They're angry. But they're I mean they're a bunch. You can everyone can have an angry neighbor buddy. Um Okay, so all the yellow ones are the, like the generics. Peter Angus and Philip. What is it? Eight. So there's. Oh, and Duchess. So there's four of them. 
and there's two of each, the yellows. And then the, these these other colored ones are the other characters, and you get their zombie war counterparts. And they, to my knowledge, are just random people. So Tiff, I, or oh no, Junior. Oh, okay, yeah, Julian, he's got a hockey mask on, or some kind of like, yeah, hockey mask. Tiff is uh, like a rock star. I don't know, I don't know why I thought of rock star, I thought of her as carrying like a guitar or something, but she's not, she's got a, she's got a bunch of axes, and then Uzi. And then Jeff here, had, also has like a fireman's axe. And a machine gun. And then you got this old guy. Adam. He's got a pistol. And they all have axes. So. Look at those guys. Angry neighbors. And then. Character cards. See? Not in the room. I keep on surprising myself. I should open this like once a month. And uh. As if it was like a brand new surprise. And these guys are black ones. Like I said, I don't remember what the black ones were. They're black and they're scary. And they're, like, they're like Matrix zombies. You can see they have like um. Long coats that are like flowing in the wind. Yeah, come out. This guy, crunch coats. Hmm. Sorry again for the blurry pieces. But this is for my friend's benefit. I probably won't keep it on my channel too long. So, yeah. So, okay, so these are the, the characters from Amy Neighbors. Joe, Adam, there's a guy with the the axe and the shotgun, looks like. Terry's got a gun. Uh, some of these guys might be from Walking Dead, like this guy, Travis. Yeah, I know Travis. He's like from, he left in season two, I think, right? 